Hello and welcome to IT Convergence User Productivity Kit tutorial series. This is a demonstration of how to integrate UPK test case into Oracle Application Testing Suite. With UPK, you can record system processes and publish test cases in an Excel workbook file format. This Excel file is then exported into Oracle Test Manager. In this demonstration, we will show how to import the file into Oracle Testing Manager, how to complete manual script creation, and how to convert the manual script into an automated script. After the test case is published, open Oracle Testing Manager and then click on Import Data from the Project menu. To locate the data, click on Browse. Select the test case published by UPK, which is an Excel file, and click on Upload. During the import process, you need to map the fields on OTM with Excel fields. Please note that only selected fields get imported into the OTM. In case there are unnecessary fields in Excel, you just select whatever fields needed for OATS, like for example test steps, action description, creation date, owner, etc. Also note that it is a one-time activity only. In this tutorial, we will demonstrate only a couple of examples. When the mapping is completed, click OK to view the import results. The file was imported as shown. Any errors due to mapping can be seen here. You can now see all the Excel steps as manual script in the OTM. We will now define a test execution strategy. First click on Test Execution tab and then click on Add. Define a test node name. In this example, we will enter Order Management Pricing Test Cases and click Save. Please note that you can also add automatic scripts modules that you have already built if needed, along with this manual script. Now click on Edit to select the script and to complete the test creation. When the Add Edit Tests in the test window appear, click on the Tree View tab and select the desired file. In this example, we will select 133 Pricing and Availability and click OK. The script is now ready for execution manually. Click on Execute Test Set and define the Test Run information. After defining the Test Run information, click on Run. We will now execute the script manually. Each step can be characterized as passed, failed or warning under the result column. In this example, we will select passed. By clicking on the expected result for each step, you can add the expected result information. In this example, we will write user is able to access the application in the summary field. You can also select all the results by clicking make all on the top of the page. In this example, we will select All as Passed and click OK. Run Manual Test Summary has to be defined before moving forward. In this example, we will enter Pricing and Availability, Test Cases Executed Successfully and click OK. Now the script is ready for conversion into an automated script. ITC has built a business process framework that can convert this script in OTM into an automated script in Oracle OpenScript as shown in the next steps. Navigate to the OpenScript application. In OpenScript, each step in UPK and OTM can be seen as an automatic step or subscript. Each of these steps again have multiple sub-steps defined underneath them. You can view the script in both Tree View and Java Code View. The automatic script is ready for launching now. Click Playback to start. From here, you can see that the script is getting executed automatically, exactly as recorded in UPK. Once the script is completed, the results can be viewed for further investigation. By clicking on the Results tab, selecting the desired file, and by clicking on Details. Here you can see the detailed results of the test. This concludes our tutorial on how to integrate UPK test case into Oracle Testing Suite. 
On the behalf of IT Convergence, I would like to thank you for your time and invite you to join IT Convergence YouTube channel, where you can learn more about User Productivity Kit features and functions.